Hi, I'm Louisa Muller. I'm directing Turn of the Screw at Garsington Opera this summer. My name is Mark Wigglesworth, and I will be conducting the performances of the Turn of the Screw at Garsington Opera this summer. The Turn of the Screw is an incredible story. It's at sort of a surface level, like a really spooky, proper spooky ghost story with some incredible chilling moments. But beneath that, it's also a sort of deep dive into the psychological journey of our protagonist, who is um, a governess who comes to this isolated remote country house to take care of the two children there and slowly begins to feel that there's a ghostly presence there and gets sort of pulled into a whole <laughs> psychological drama of trying to save the children from these ghosts. The Turn of the Screw is a very enigmatic story and one never quite knows what one should think. And so music is an ideal medium to express that because music is indefinable and you can never quite pinpoint exactly what it means. And so using notes rather than words enables i think the listener to come to their own conclusion a little more easily than they would if they were reading a book and that makes the experience very personal i'm really planning to tackle the piece almost from scratch again um, i think the luxury of having a new cast is that we can really have a proper process um, from start to finish and the new collaboration with a new conductor. Um, it's, it's something where I think the elements of the production that are, are fixed, that we know really worked well, we will absolutely keep in place. But I'm really thrilled to look at it through new eyes, um, new children, which is a totally different energy, new adult cast members. I think it's gonna feel fresh. I'm, I'm, I'm bringing a fresh energy to it for sure. This is a chamber opera, which means that the orchestra is very small and very individually scored for. And I think that is a huge part of the power of the piece because there's an intensity that comes from a individual expression of the instrumental line. The fact that you have to really listen forces you, I think, to be an active part of the performance. And to have these solo parts played by um, musicians of the Philharmonic Orchestra, I think, will be fantastic because you hear, you will hear their individuality, their expression, just as you do a singer on the stage. And that is a very complete experience that you're getting a similar type of communication from both the pit and the singers. There's something so special about doing this particular piece in the setting of Garsington. I think any show you do, in the theater at Garsington, you're so affected by its by the environment around it. And Christopher Oram and I really chose to absolutely capitalize on on the setting, which is of course an isolated country house um, with a lake, <laughs> which is just exactly where Turn of the Screw is set as well. And in making in setting our piece really in a glass house within the glass house that is the theater we, I think, found a really beautiful progression where in the audience, you start with a quite expansive view of the space and everything around it. And as it gets darker, it mirrors the journey of the piece, sort of getting darker and darker, getting pulled further and further into the story. So that by the very end, when it's really properly dark outside, you're just right there in it. And I think it, I can't imagine a better place to do this piece. <laughs>